वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम फाइव डैश थर्टी फाइव सो स्टेटमेंट इज द ट्वेंटी फाइव मिलीमीटर डायमीटर शॉफ्ट ऑफ मोटर इज मेड ऑफ मटीरियल हैविंग अलाउेबल शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस इज सेवेंटी फाइव मेगा पासकल इफ मोटर इज ऑपरेटिंग एट इट्स मैक्सिम पावर ऑफ फाइव किलो वाट डिटरमाइन द मिनिमम अलाउेबल रोटेशन ऑफ द शॉफ्ट सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द मोटर एंड दिस इज द शॉफ्ट विच इज रोटेटिंग विद सम एंगुलर विलासिटी क्लियर and this diameter of the shaft is 25 mm while radius of this shaft is c which is equal to d by 2 so 25 divided by 2 is 12.5 mm the allowable maximum allowable shearing stress is 75 mega pascal and power of this motor is 5 km 5 kw so you have to determine the minimum allowable rotation of this shaft so let's start with the solution so as we know that uh, power is equal to torque into angular velocity so we are interested to find this rotation or angular velocity of the shaft so w is equal to power divided by torque clear so we will find this torque uh, so first torque t and we know that uh, maximum shear allowable shearing stress is for due to torsion or torque is equal to t into c divided by j what is j j is the polar moment of inertia and for circular shaft it is equal to pi by 2 c power 4 so pi by 2 C is twelve point five millimeter. So in term of meter, it is zero point zero one two five power four. This is power. So when you calculate it, you will get J is equal to thirty eight point three four nine five into ten is to power minus nine meter power four. this is j now c is equal to 0.0125 meter clear and torque is also available so you can just put in this formula sorry uh, maximum allowable shearing stress so maximum allowable shearing stress is 75 mega pascal so 75 into 10 to power 6 is equal to torque into 0.0125 divide by 38.3495 into 10 to the power minus 9 clear so from here you will get torque t is equal to 75 into 10 to the power 6 multiply by 38.3495 into 10 to the power minus 9 divide by 0.0125 5 so when you calculate it you will get torque is equal to 230.10 and unit will be newton into meter now you have this torque clear so you can just put it in this formula uh, from here this w is equal to p divided by t so power is 5 kilowatt so 5 into 10 to the power 3 divide by torque is 230.10 there and when you solve this you will get angular velocity is equal to 21.7 radian per second so this is the minimum angular velocity or minimum allowable rotation of the shaft or angular velocity uh, of this motor and that was all about this problem 5-35 i hope you have enjoyed this video those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and press the bell icon clear so that you can get notification about my latest video if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching